Hi there. How the heck are you? I am trying something, well, sort of new, I guess. Um, Springfield Brewing Company, Walnut Street Wheat. This is about a hundred plus day out there. Uh, and this is the kind of beer you want to have on a day like this. Uh, I, you know, uh, back in the mid '90s when brew pubs really started flying, I was big into the wheats. Uh, over the last few years, not so much. Uh, but I did want to try this one to kind of compare it um, to others. Uh, Walnut Street Wheat uh, from uh, Springfield Brewing Company. Um, brew pub popped up in the late '90s. And, uh, well, uh, about a year ago, they underwent some management changes, and now they have this beer. Uh, well, I mean, you know, they've always had beer, but, uh, uh, some of them, they just kind of, they, they did go under the name of, uh, Mueller's, and now, uh, uh, they have the names. This their wheat is called Walnut Street Wheat. Uh, they don't give me... Oh, holy crap. They don't give me their stats, so I don't know. Uh, so I'm going to have to guess with you. Um, wheats are generally light. Um, some lighter than others, uh, but most of them are st stay pretty light, especially in this area. Uh, one of the big ones out here is Boulevard Wheat. Um, and it's very popular because uh, it's, you know, it's, it's around here anyway. It's what, you know, the Bud and Bud Light drinkers, you know, buy when they want to have something, you know, good. Uh, I had the Pilsner the other day, and it kind of uh, wowed me a little bit. In fact, it, it is a very light beer. It, it wasn't the flavor itself that wowed me. It was just the pure drinkability of it, because I took a sip, and it seemed kind of average at the time, but the more I sipped it, the more I, the more I drank it, the more I went, holy crap, that's tasty beer. Um, i got a feeling this one's going to do the same thing to me, to be honest, because... Uh, mm. You are not overwhelmed with flavor. Uh, again, this this isn't this this isn't that that German, uh, you know that that, that big German Hefeweizen. This one is, is is a lighter American version, but there is something incredibly crisp and refreshing about it. Oh, beers like this, you know, for here anyway, are kind of meant to be that you know that that. Da, 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 that uh, whoo, that <laughs> that lawnmower type beer, you know that you know it's crazy hundred and five or something. You can come in and just just kind of relax, you know. Now, you, you you might want that IPA or double IPA later in the day. Uh, you might even want a stat for whatever reason. But when you're just walking in from from a hot hot weather, you don't want to well, you don't want that one right away. You want something that that's going to be refreshing, give you a little flavor. Yeah, but just 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 kind of absorb in you and make you feel better real quick. Oh gosh, and this is a beer that's going to do that. Actually, um, well, frankly, uh, I was I was kind of thrown off by the Pilsner too because I thought it was a little lighter than it ought to be. And this one too, uh, I saw how light it was and I thought, oh my gosh, it's going to taste like nothing. Uh, and, and again, you're not, you know. It's not crazy flavor, but it's it is there, uh, and it's just enough to kind of sit in there and be going, oh, that's nice. Uh, and it is that 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 perfect, you know, uh, hundred degree session. You know, if you're picnicking or something, you know, this is one that you you could sit and drink two to six of, and not get whacked wackadoodled. So, uh, if I had to guess an ABV, I'd probably guess it closer to the four and a half. Ranged in the five percent range, but it's probably somewhere between four and a half and five. But if I was a guessing man, I'm going to guess it closer to four and a half. I've used. Uh, I'm going to guess it's light. I'm going to say it's somewhere between ten and twelve. And I'm hoping somebody from the brewery watches. 
for whatever reason, watches my video and corrects me. But anyway, oh, I was trying to keep it under five minutes. I drifted over again. So I'm going to go. It's time to beer whisper. Walnut Street Wheat. Enjoy it. <laughs>